Hello folks, it's me, I'm Biggie, and I'm back, and uh, this is an update video which I haven't done in a while, but long story short, if you don't have the time to watch the rest of this video, the most important thing is that my birthday stream is coming up, so if you have any ideas on what you want to see me do on stream, yes, that's correct, uh, comment down below, make sure you upvote the things that you'd like to see, and uh, yeah, top comments will definitely be considered considered being the keyword here and yeah i'll make sure i'll link to the uh, live stream down below so you could actually uh go there preemptively like it etc and click on the bell notification icon to get notified for when i go live so you could join in on the fun uh that being said though uh that's the main point of this video and the rest of the video i'll just be talking about uh things going on with my life mainly things like changes to the channel or uh my health and my life how's it been since uh i lost my job how's it been having to do much more stuff um than before and how it's been quite challenging over these past few weeks yeah that being said though yeah so first of all, I'm just going to talk about mainly how the channel's changing. Um, as you can see here that uh, because I've actually had to pivot and make more time to do my translation paperwork, uh, that kind of stuff, uh, I've only managed to, instead of streaming maybe four or five times a week, I've, I've gone down to twice a week, uh, three times if I'm good. Yeah, and I had to spend the rest of the days doing translation work. And it's been a bit of a challenge. Because, yeah, recently, uh, it's kind of a good and bad news at the same time. But recently, I'm having trouble sitting up a bit more because I'm recovering. And I'm feeling a lot more stuff going on down here, down my belly area, down my leg area. And it's causing me to not basically be able to sit up for longer periods of time. I used to sit up straight uh, for six hours. Now it's three, maybe topping off at four if I do it well enough. And uh, yeah, it involves me putting on some weight. So I need to actually lose some weight. And yeah, that's going to be part of the journey now. And uh, right now I am one week into keto. And it's racking up and giving me a lot of trouble with the, my ability of sitting up for long periods of time. But that's just the first week. That's that's the main thing. And uh, hopefully my metabolism, etc. catches up with me. So I could be able to live stream um, and do work and sit for long periods of time. Like doing this video update is already gi giving getting me gassed out because so much of my torso is being constricted. But yeah, anyways, that's all uh, part of my health and recovery. Um, like guys, like everybody said, no pain, no gain. And uh, it's going to take me a little while just to get used to this new routine. Um, and hopefully my work, uh, my first project will be done by the end of March. Hopefully things go well by then, and it's going to be uh, my, my translation project, not this uh, YouTube channel. Uh, I'll be able to return to more regular scheduled programming, but more importantly, I probably have to look for some more work to get done in the meantime, uh, so that it tides me over for uh, the month following, etc. But yeah, that's enough about um, my life. Um, on the other note is that, um, yeah, health-wise, I need to talk about this as well. Uh, yeah, I've always said the squeaky wheel gets to grease, right? So um, I've been talking about how uh, the doctor refused to uh, diagnose me further for an accident that happened in June of last year. And basically, they've been ignoring it for the past six months. And finally... Once my leg has atrophied to the point where they said that, look, this isn't normal. This isn't 
this isn't something that's just gonna uh, heal itself in a couple of weeks, uh, like they said initially. <laughs> but yeah, that's that's how. Uh, this is all free healthcare. This is all government healthcare. So, I I sympathize. Uh, I only managed to actually get to meet them uh, two to three times since. So, yeah, it takes it it takes me getting uh, talking to them and. You know, being a little bit more assertive to say that this isn't normal. Um, but hopefully, uh, but not hopefully, actually, uh, I managed to finally gotten my uh, doctor to look further into it, do some more uh, diagnoses so that we could see what we could actually do to so get this thing recovered. Um, but anyways, long st uh, to summarize, to for those of you who don't understand what I'm saying, uh, leg bad, been bad for six months, no, eight months, finally got the doctor to look at it. Yeah, so, um, and I actually had to ask them, so, okay, can I get some medical records so I could go get a second opinion? So, wait, 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 don't go th do that yet. And uh, Yeah, that's part of the whole thing. But yeah, I think that's uh, mainly what's going to happen. But, um, what's another thing that I need to talk about is... Since I'm streaming less, uh, I needed to talk about how my channel... Recently, I have been delving into short-form content, uh, clipping things from Twitch. Clipping things from Twitch seems to be uh, a lot easier nowadays. So I've been clipping stuff from my live streams that I do a live stream uh, here and on Twitch. And uh, I use Twitch to clip older episodes into compilations and... Uh, best cuts of the funniest things that happen on stream so those things are being uploaded daily and uh so if you guys want to check those out feel free but of course members get first dibs as soon as i'm done editing all the clips members get to watch them all at at, uh, at once if you click on the short itself like my channel name and go to my shorts there's a bunch of member only stuff that gets released on a daily basis basically so Binge watchers get um, dibs on that, but if you wait, it'll just get uh, released eventually. And at the end of each month, uh, we're going to have a compilation of uh, the best bits of that month, I think. But uh, that's just pretty much it. That's all I have to say for now, other than the fact that I really, really appreciate you guys for being here. I mean, like, life, it's, it's been almost five years since my accident, right? And life has certainly taken a detour for a long time. <laughs> That's not the word I wanted to say, but life has, my life has taken, uh, taken a detour. And I thought that it might have taken me five years to get me back standing again. And five years in, I'm where I am right now. And look, I have to appreciate what I have. I have a bunch of you guys watching. Uh, I have interaction in my stream. I've got uh, members who are willing to contribute and help me out with my medical stuff. And yeah, I'm just... Thank you, Leg, for interrupting. But thank you, Leg, for interrupting. But, yeah, I'll, I'll take this opportunity to just bow and thank you. Anyways, but, um, yeah, you guys are amazing for being around and helping out and uh, checking things out as they are and giving me the help that I need. That's all I wanted to say. Just thank you. I mean, I'll give proper thanks definitely on the birthday stream and I'll just make sure that everybody gets... I want you guys to get acknowledged that you're watching. I just want to thank you for actually... But yeah, I think... Um, anyways, thanks for being here. Um, and hopefully, as things go on, as my channel progresses, and as my content changes, um we'll see how things go from then i might make a new channel introduction video as well since my content's pivoted so much but yeah me i'm biggie 
and I'll be back. Check me out on stream sometime and uh, enjoy my shorts in the meantime when you're not here. Or when I'm not here. <laughs> yeah. Thanks for being here, guys. See you guys in a bit.